My friend Lauren is getting married next month and everyone is so excited for her. I'm actually sitting in her bedroom where she is gathering all the stuff for the wedding and the reception. You can see flowers here, uh, a sign, that's super fun, bottles in the back kind of in their theme, bridesmaid bouquets, we've got candles, um, the rings, this is legit, these are actually the wedding rings. And of course her wedding dress. She doesn't know that I'm just like draping it over myself. <laughs> I'm gonna not put it on, trust me. Um, but anyway, it's so cool and it's so fun to be able to celebrate with her and with her family. And I know she's excited to start um, her life together with her soon to be husband. And it reminds me of what I say in chapter two of the Dating Manifesto, um, where I talk about how young adults really need a vision for marriage. It's very easy for us to get a vision for a wedding. A wedding is fun to plan. All of a sudden we're tasting cakes and picking out dresses and music and all that stuff. But uh, a wedding is, uh, is forever within your lifetime, um, God willing. And it needs a lot of preparation as well. And it begins before you even have, uh, before you've even met someone. And so in chapter two, I really encourage uh, young adults to get a vision for marriage, understand what it is, why God designed it, what he intends for it, and how you can maximize it um, in your own future and really anticipate it and love it and even support the marriages around you while you're still single. And so join me in this journey as we start out uh, again, on the front end of the book here, talking about marriage, and uh, then we'll go into dating later on. But marriage is our end goal, and so uh, let's look forward to it with purpose and have fun in the process.